What's going on guys, Demon here, bringing our Black Ops 2 gameplay commentary, and I know I said I'm not going to be doing a whole lot of Black Ops, but I've actually Black been enjoying playing it uh, as of late, and a couple of reasons why, and I'm going to talk to you about that, and I'm also going to talk to you about something you guys like me to talk about, and that's how to get better at playing Call of Duty, or really, my, my topic today is really any competitive game, but... Specifically, we're going to talk about Call of Duty today. Um, so I know I said I wasn't going to do uh, a whole lot of Call of Duty stuff anymore, and I was going to start, you know, showing more games from PC gaming. Like I've been playing uh, Bioshock Infinite right now, and I'm absolutely loving it. Uh, had to take a break from it though. I'll be picking that up again here in a little bit. But I've been absolutely loving Bioshock Infinite, um, and just picked up a couple more games on Steam this last week that I haven't even got a chance to play. I got like 15 games on my PC I haven't even touched. Um, but really, really enjoying that. So, this particular game, this is Arms Race. This is one of the new bonus games that they put in. Um, it's nothing really super special. It's Team Deathmatch with more points. So you can get score streaks faster. That's pretty much all it is. Um... Had a really good game, went 33 and 4. As you guys can see, I'm using a light machine gun. Now, this is not my typical playstyle. For those of you who watch my channel pretty regularly, you know that I typically rush around. I don't sit back and use these kinds of weapons because it's almost impossible to rush with a light machine gun. I'm not saying it is impossible because I know someone out there is going to be like, I do it all the time. But, <laughs> sorry. Uh, it's, it's almost impossible because it feels like you're running in water. And so you have to, you know, adapt your playstyle to a more defensive uh, type of playstyle. That's why you see the target finders. Why you see me really holding down an area of the map, waiting for them to come to me, so I can get those kills. And that's what I mean when I'm talking about how I'm going to help you guys get better at Call of Duty. It seems like common sense, but a lot of people really don't do it. And you need to change or adapt your playstyle to the class or weaponry that you're using and what you're good at in order to be successful. If you're good at rushing, then you shouldn't be sitting back with a light machine gun or a sniper rifle like I am. I am a good rusher. And because that, that's why I use a lot of shotguns, submachine guns, and I adjust my class to, to aid me in that, for lack of better terminology. I adjust my class to aid me in what I'm good at, which is rushing and navigating the map. As far as precision, I told you guys before, and I'll be the first one to tell anyone, I don't have the best aim in Call of Duty. That's not why I'm uh, I'm decent at this game. It's The reason I'm decent is because of my map navigation. That's how I get the kills and uh, things like that. And right here, man, I could have had another set of score streaks, but I just freaking ran out of ammo and couldn't reload fast enough. They were coming for me. But, you know, I, I don't have the best aim in Call of Duty. I don't have the best aim with shooters in general. I'm good at anticipating player movement and navigating the map. That's why I do all the map tutorials. That's why I've done all the map tutorials, uh, things like that. That's actually how I was, you know, efficient at sniping, as I could get into a position where they don't expect me to be there and get the kills that way. It wasn't because I have those twitch reflexes that allow me to get the kills. So set up your class in order that suits your playstyle the best. And don't worry about what other people freaking say. Their stuff is in the game for a reason. Okay, so if you do better sitting back playing defensive with a target finder and a SWAT, or target finder, and I think it's an M8A1 or whatever it is, the, the burst assault rifle, and you can get, you know, and you can aid your team. Remember, play game types that aid your play style too. Don't be playing... You know, domination if you're going to be sitting in the corner the whole time. People like you drive me nuts. Play the game type that's going to suit you best. If you if you are better playing super defensive, then you need to play a game like Team Deathmatch where your KD is actually what impacts the overall team effort. And I think a lot of people need to refocus on that. Team Deathmatch is the only game type where your KD means a damn thing. Honestly, it really is. So... For instance, in this game, I think I go 33 and 4 or something like that. Playing defensively helped. It helped more than if I was going to be rushing. Because if I was rushing, I probably would have got 30 or so kills and I would have been a real nuisance to the other team. But I probably would have had 15, 16, 17 deaths. You know, most games, as far as team deathmatch, my average game 
is normally a two KD. A two KD. It's like I go like twenty and ten on average. Um, every once in a while, I'll have a, a standout game where I go like thirty something and four. And you know, realistically, that has a lot to do with score streaks. If you get your score streaks once, you know that takes a twenty and ten game to thirty and ten, or you know, depending on how many deaths that you have. But the main thing I wanted to talk to you guys about, and the game's coming to a close here, the main thing I wanted to talk to you guys about, in order to improve your gameplay, be sure to set up your class that's going to suit what you're good at the best. And also, play the correct game type. If you're highly defensive and you're super worried about KD, play Team Deathmatch. That's where you're going to have the most success. If you're a rusher, then you're probably better at more objective-based games and you know weapons like shotguns and submachine guns. All right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. Remember, follow me on Twitter, add me on Facebook. This is Demon, and I'm out. Peace.